Hey YouTube, I've been checking out a lot of videos on YouTube on toolbox tours and stuff like that on people showing how they organize their tools and um, what tools they use. So I decided to put this video together just because when I started building, uh, putting this box together, I, I, I didn't see many videos on tool carts. So here's my tool cart tour. It's a Mako, Mako tool cart. Um, so there's a the top, top side of it. I got my Phillips screwdrivers and my pry bars on the left hand side. The right hand side has my flatheads, my picks, my breaker bar, my impact sockets I keep up here. I mostly use metric, I don't use anything standard. Um, I use the Matco twist lock socket holders just because I, they have a magnet on them. I keep them on the lid of the, of the cart and it gives me extra space in the drawers. So these Mac, Matco magnets came in handy a lot. As you can see, they keep, they keep a lot of stuff up there. Twist lock is great because you close the lid down, nothing falls off. There's only one screwdriver that's always falling off on me. This little guy, he's always falling, but I don't know why. Um, so yeah, these these are Mac Michael magnets right here. All three of these. This socket holder is made by Westling Machine. I really recommend those socket holders, guys. They look very nice. Keep stuff in place. It doesn't move around. Just pick up and go. All right, so that's the top side of the box. Keep a flashlight up here because we always need flashlights. That's text, right? All right, first first drawer here. I get, keep my pliers, all those hand tools and stuff like that. I got this from Amazon. It's called uh, Olsa Tools Plier Organizer. I used to have the pliers all over the place in here, so that came came in handy a lot. So that's that drawer, guys. Now, after making all that space and using all these organizers, it did save me an extra drawer in here. And this is a Western machine with socket holders for the standard half uh, half point. I mean, for the half half inch sockets. I don't have any standards, so it's just there. I will ha I will get some eventually. Middle drawer this is my favorite drawer, guys. So this is where I keep all the sockets, my wrenches, ratchets. Um, I got another Mako magnet up there. That's a very thin one, and it's very, very strong, guys. That thing can hold some weight. I've had impact sockets like these. I had like six of them at the same time and holding all that other stuff. There's the, the socket holders again, guys. The Westling machines. Very nice socket holders, like I said. They have very nice colors. It's a metal anodized look. Gear wrench, uh, wrenches. Flex head. These are very good, guys. I recommend these wrenches. So that's my middle drawer. Bottom drawer right here. I keep the chargers and all the bigger stuff. I got the wheel lock breaker, Allen wrenches, um, the big sets, rotor mic, gloves, air gun. You know, just an example of um, how I how I organize my stuff. It's just so you guys can get ideas, and it's it's not a a monster cart either. I had those decals made at the mall. Bottom, I keep um mostly well. There's the oil filter um tools and stuff like that. And, you know, towels, funnels, uh, torque wrench. And if you guys are wondering uh, all about all these little characters here, it's just this one. My mom gave it to me at a stocking stuffer for Christmas, so I just decided to put it there. It's actually a Bluetooth speaker, so it's pretty cool. Um, the little guys, the minions, and the Joker. I took my daughter to Toys R Us before um, they closed down, and I saw the little guys, and I just decided to buy them and put them in the box just to keep like a little memory from Toys R Us since I grew up in the '90s. Um, also, on these things right here, I put magnets. I put magnets just because I don't want this stuff in the drawers taking up space. Even even the minions, little guys, I put little magnets on them just so they don't move around. I can close the lid, and these guys won't fall. You know. The hood strut holder also has a magnet on it 
Nothing in my box moves around. I've moved the box around when I was at the shop. Nothing moves. So that's it, guys. That's my toolbox tour. If you guys have any questions, feel free to message me. Um, I think I mentioned where I got all my organizers, which is just the magnets, the Mako, uh, Westling socket holders. I got the eight. They come out. It's an eight piece set. Very well done. Very well made, and the numbers are very clear. Now, if you're looking on to look at the numbers, then I keep away from the green. Because if you see, it's very hard to read the, the white lettering on, on, on this color green. But on the orange, it's, it's no problem. They have blue, red, black, whatever. So that's it, guys. That's my toolbox tour of a Michael Kart. Feel free to ask any questions.